I'm John Sobel. I'm the director of DevOps Engineering. And I'm Andy Newman, an enterprise architect out of the office of the CTO. And we're here to tell you a little bit about our accomplishments this year in the area of identity and access management. This year, we've introduced a third generation identity and access management framework that includes enhanced authentication, enhanced directory services, uh, a new model for managing identity data, as well as revised systems for the overall life cycle of our identity and access management artifacts. And specifically, we've introduced an identity data repository, or the IDR, which is a single source for identity information for all systems and users needing access to directory and identity information. We have also introduced a provisioning identity entitlements and role system, or PEER, which will provide for a single source of truth for identity data. And finally, we have enhanced and extended our authentication and federation services, specifically tacifying more systems and creating more single sign-on with Shibboleth. In addition, we've introduced multi-factor authentication to enable more secure access to our systems. Services allow researchers to collaborate more easily and in a more secure environment. We've joined a consortium of universities called TIER, or Trust and Identity in Education and Research, a group of individuals whose purpose is to move forward the state-of-the-art standards and practices in higher education, authentication, identity access, and management. In addition to implementing the systems we discussed previously, we have also built a factory model so that we will be able to roll out our identity authentication and directory services increasingly to replace legacy systems, creating an environment that is more nimble, that is easier to support, and that provides for faster adoption and integration of new systems. Thank you for spending a minute with us to learn a little bit more about what we're doing in identity and access management. If you'd like more information, please contact me or Andy.